What's up everybody, welcome back to another drawing tutorial, Gojo's domain expansion from the Shibuya incident, right? I'm on a landscape page, use a pencil eraser, hit pause if I go too fast. So he's got those two fingers up to the camera, right? So imagine like we're the camera, basically. So his head is in behind that, okay? So, where to begin? I'd say, I'd say we'll do those fingers first. It's kind of blurry, okay. Send your point to my page about here. We'll go down, put the fingers in like the bottom half. So we can see like a fingernail. Sort of there. It curves around. And then his finger goes out there. Pretty much straight down. Kind of bumping. And then we got like some skin on his knuckles. And it crisscrosses another finger. This goes down and then. We get that crisscross section. Like that. And then this knuckle sticks out here, down, down, down to there. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> and then we can see the tip of this finger sticking out this way. All right, fingernail and just the tip of the finger. All right. <coughs> and then there's a knuckle, like a bent over finger on the bottom. down there and then his thumb sort of sticks up here somewhere okay so we can't really see his eyes or his nose that well so like his collar then comes out from behind the fingers. So we're building, we're drawing this portrait different to what I usually do because the fingers kind of mess everything up, right? There's his face is kind of covered. So we'll just get everything in the right place first. This is his like hood or his big collar, right? That comes around his head. And then his shoulder sort of goes off that way. Right, and then this collar goes in behind the head. Over there somewhere. So he's all sort of hair and all that kind of stuff. So his eyes, so say like, we can see like some of his eye, it's kind of like underneath hair. So we'll probably have to, let's see. Right, we'll do, we'll get the jaw in. So the jaw goes down that way. And his neck there. Same pretty much on this side. And his neck here, okay? And then there's loads of hair and stuff. Right, so we see, we can see like his eye here. So like his eye carving, it's like it nearly in line with the top of this. Carving over and down like there, right? And then the bottom eyelid just comes around this way. Sort of up. And that goes underneath hair, so you can't really see all that. But his iris and pupil, we can see fully wide, open circle with a dot in the middle. Okay, and then this is like, it, this has all sort of eyelash lines and stuff on it, right? So, and they, they normally draw it in. And then, like 
bits of eyelashes along the bottom. And you could finish this if you want, but it does go underneath hair, so I think I'll just stop it there. And that's all sort of like purple under there. And then we've got like an eyelid line going across the top and a bit of an eyebrow in here. But we can't see it really, it's all purple in there. Because of the hair. So we can see like a bit of a nose line right here. And like another sort of eye line there. And then we can see his mouth sort of here downturned and a bit of teeth. Again, the hair is all coming over these eyes now, so it's tricky enough. So the other eye, just here, right? And you can't see any of this. I'll put the pupil in, right? The iris and the pupil. And then there's just sort of hair that covers this. Loads and loads of hair spikes. You could draw the full eye if you wanted, but it's quicker, I think. Just doing this, right? And then we can see some of that eyelash eyelid line just sort of underneath here. Eyelid line going that way, yeah, and then like eyelashes just underneath there. Like an eyelid line there, and maybe like bit of eyebrow or something sort of going that way right so we'll finish that fringe and then put some more details in rounds right so hair spike all here coming across here then as well Covers a lot of this eye as well. Up like so. So that'll all be erased, that'll be erased. Here, right so then this continues like real wavy sort of around his head so, where does that go so that's like up around here
right and then more on this side lines in the middle here do 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 and what are we missing there's like a single sort of hair strand here oh and his ears missing his ears Like that. I think that's everything. I can't see anything else anyway. So you could draw like the whole eye as well and erase afterwards. So, or, you know, draw the hair first. It's kind of up to you what way you want to do it. So you could just copy the eye on this side. That was easier, of course. Anyway, Shibuya Domain Expansion Gojo. Hope it's helpful. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.